Hey guys, welcome to my new video. In this video, I'll be showing three text animations in After Effects. Let's get started. So guys, welcome back and first of all, I want to show how to create jump text animation. Let's go to text and right here, H, classification tool and change font size and font color to black. And don't forget to move the anchor point down. Let's go to click this icon, pen behind and move the anchor point down like this. Classification tool and let's enable title action save Move to center go to align if you not see this part go to window and enable align and Click this icon for move to center and this icon So select this H and control D for duplicate move to right And let's double click right E Classification tool again control D and move to right and right Y classification tool so in this time let's move to left a little bit okay so in this time select these three layers move to left for center and right now we can select these text layers let's click these all caps and select these three layers and press P make new pass in keyframe and move it down go to 10 keyframes for shortcut you can use hold shift press page down let me show other way click time duration write plus 10 click OK and let's move it up go to 10 keyframes again and move it down like this so select keyframes make easy or click f9 let's say animation okay select these keyframes go to graph editor and let's select these middle keyframes move to left and move to right okay and let's back to keyframes select last keyframes let's move to down a little bit okay select keyframes again go to graph editor select these middle keyframes let's move to right and select last keyframes move to right okay not bad so back to keyframes and go to first second select this h layer and hold shift press s open scale click this icon and make scale keyframe go to middle change scale 80 and go to last keyframe change 100 percent so in this time let's go to three keyframes for go to frame by frame use page down in keyboard okay and let's change this scale 120 and this 80 Go to three keyframes again, one to three, and change this 90, and this 110. Go to three keyframes again, one to three, change this 100%, and this 100%. So select scale keyframes, make easy. Let's see. Let's go to solo. Okay, select these last four keyframes. Move to left, move to left more, nice, back to keyframes and select these all scale keyframes, let's copy and go to first second, select layer E and Y, Control V for paste and press U for C, active keyframes, nice and select these all layers, close settings, select these layer E, move to right and select this Y, move to right let's see nice, very good so 
so guys right now let's go to text and right here hello and clusation tool move to center let's enable title action save go to align click this and this icons go to character and let's search font my favorite font gabo dive and select this gabo drive let's use okay change font size and in this time let's right mouse go to conversation settings go to 3d render and select render cinema 4d click ok and let's change quality quarter select this text and click 3d icon for 3d text layer open inside and geometry options and we can see here extrusion deep let's change view one and change deep like this okay go to text color select this blue click ok and let's change bevel style convex and go to here let's open stroke color select dark blue click ok so change view active camera okay and in this time i will use animation comes as three for text animation also i will add link how to use and how to get animation comes as three select hello and go to window open animation comes as three and let's open starter preset and text layer and animate characters let's select this overshot animation or this okay click in and let's see nice and let's select this mark moved right for slow animation and let's select this text layer press air open rotation and right now make y rotation keyframe and go to back and chain rotation like this let's change 150 percent and select first keyframe move to left select keyframes make easy or click f9 and let's select work area let's animation nice let's select this mark move to left for more fast animation okay select last keyframe go to graph editor and let's move to right And let's move to left this graph. Okay, I like it. So back to keyframes. Let's go to browse. And let's close this folder. Open FX2D layer. And let's open here. Select this folder. And I will use this rotate animation. Select text layer. And select this rotate click apply and close window change intensity 10 or change 5 okay let's do loop animation nice very good and in this time let's go to rotation and go to 10 frames change rotation minus 15 go to 10 q frames change 15 again 10 q frames change minus 15 again 10 q frames change 15 and again minus 15 we can make duplicates q frames okay and next 15 q frames okay let's see nice and we can add x rotation let's go to here change 10 or minus 10 go 10 q frame change 10 again 10 q frame change minus 10 and again and make q frames easy and select all q frames hold alt move to right
Okay, very nice. And let's select these two frames, move to the left. Okay, that's good. So guys, welcome to last part and in this part I will show you how to make bounce text animation. Go to text layer and let's write here motion design. Equalization tool and change font. Let's change Golos text and font size 50. Color change to black. And let's change quality full. And in this time go to align. And click this icon and this icon. Press S, change scale to 100. Okay, so open text inside and go to animate. Let's add new position and change this position minus 100%. And open range selector one. And let's make offset Q frame, change 100%. And go to one second change 100 let's see okay so in this time open advanced and change shape ramp down and change either high 100 percent let's say again okay and let's close animator one and select this animator one control d for duplicate open animator two inside and change position 50 open range selector one and open advanced and change is highs 50 and is low also 50 let's animation okay as you can see our smooth text animation and let's close animator 2 and let's select this animator 2 control d for duplicate open animator 3 and chain position minus 10. Right now, select this motion design, press U for C active keyframes, and select this. These keyframes move to right, and this move to right for keyframe by animation. Okay, nice. So, in this time, let's close again, open inside, and let's select this animator 1, and let's change minus position to minus 200 let's see okay select this motion design let's move to down move to down more okay and let's select this animator 2 and change this position 100 percent let's select this text and move to center like this okay very nice and close these animators area and let's go to animate select this opacity and go to first second change opacity zero percent and open the range selector make start keyframe and go to here change 100 percent let's see okay select last keyframe move to right nice very good so guys, thank you for watching my video and don't forget to subscribe to the channel, like video and please follow me on Instagram. Good luck.